Chad Wheeler's ex-girlfriend speaks out following his domestic violence charges. Aaliyah Taylor talks with CBS this morning and details her account of what allegedly happened. I looked down and there was, there was blood on my hand. And I, I remember getting up and running to the bathroom. Chad was standing by the bed by the doorway and he was sipping his smoothie. And it's like, wow, you're, you're still alive. Aaliyah says she texted Chad's father and stated Chad was trying to, quote, kill her. I had texted his dad too and told him that Chad was trying to kill me. Chad's dad called him while he was eating and while I was in the bathroom. And he answered and he didn't have any worry at all. And, he, and Chad was like, I'm just eating dinner. Nothing's going on. And that, that terrified me. The former NFL player was formally charged with domestic violence on January 27th. The same day, the Seattle Seahawks announced that Chad had been released from the team. According to court documents obtained by E! News, the athlete was charged with first-degree domestic violence assault, domestic violence, unlawful imprisonment, and resisting arrest. Documents allege that he strangled the victim until she lost consciousness. He posted bail and has pleaded not guilty to the charges. Wheeler spoke out after his arrest in a series of now-deleted tweets saying, Events happened over the weekend that transpired from a manic episode. I am deeply sorry for the pain and suffering that I have caused to Aaliyah and her family. To get help for yourself or someone you love, visit the website for the National Domestic Violence Hotline at thehotline.org or call 1-800-799-7233.